A clash that had all the hallmarks of the cliched relegation six-pointer. Bottom of the table, Bordeaux hosting 19th place, Mess. Same points, same desperation for more. A win for either side would propel them two points from safety after Saint-Étienne and Clermont suffered heavy defeats. David Guignon still searching his first win as Bordeaux boss. And the Girondin hadn't beaten Metz in any of the last three Ligue 1 Uber Eats encounters. Bordeaux on top in the blazing sun. Wang Ujo in a pick out. And Joshua Kilavogu couldn't get his header under the bar. Ending a six hour wait for a goal and a 6 1 thrashing by Rennes. Metz at least didn't have to wait so long for another. And this one had greater significance. A stunning header from Didier Lamkelze. His first goal since Antwerp swapped his contract on loan from Russia to France. Nicolas de Préville with a brilliant pick out. Well, as things stood, Metz were leaving Bordeaux adrift. Defeat would surely be the final nail in the Girondin coffin and send them to a first relegation since 1991. But they returned with a renewed attitude. Guillon knew his side had been on top during the first half, but then they finally found what they needed, and that was goals. Ricardo Mangas with his second of the season, both at the Matmut. More importantly, Bordeaux's first goal since late February, after drawing blanks in their last four league outings. His last goal came in a 3-2 loss against Alonso. The Portuguese this time would hope to be on the winning side. Itan Poussin certainly showing his delight. A miss. Missed their own chances and they were punished dearly. Mbain Yang rediscovering the form that made him such a fearsome Ligue 1 Uber Eats predator. Poking in. 22 minutes to go, and after Thomas Delane smashed over from the penalty spot at the other end, Wang Ujo pounced. And the keeper missed the ball in no man's land. A first win in seven since David Guillon took over to take Bordeaux within touching distance of safety, while Mess running out of time and points to save themselves.